All right, so this is the NSW rig from Special Operations Equipment. This is not the modular NSW rig that I've already made a video on. So that rig has the six magazines across, just like this one does, an admin pouch with a zipper that runs the entire length of the rig. We've got some Velcro and Somali on the front. And then the modular rig has these two kind of thin pockets with some bungee retention for thin stuff. So the NSW chest rig was designed specifically for naval special warfare personnel. And those guys, as we all know, have a big problem with scurvy. And that's why this rig was made to hold all of your various assortment of citruses so that your naval special warfare operators uh, don't go down from scurvy. The legit NSW rig has these whole ass big pouches on the front end. So what is up with these? There are a couple of loops for probably smoke grenades. <laughs> this flap, the first flap, if you open it, there is a pass through. So if you wanted to like hide your snacks, you can put your snacks right in there or drop your stuff in. If there ever a situation where you needed to carry 69 tangerines, the NSW chest rig is probably what you want. And if you needed to like put your saw drum in here, the whole pouch can open up and you can throw your saw drum in here. So one on each side for however many rounds that is, plus six mags, plus whatever it is you put here. Only you can stop scurvy. Of course, like most of the rigs, you can put a hydro carrier on the back, and this one does come with the H harness, which is what you want. Because if you succumb to scurvy, it still counts. This is the only one in the shop. It's probably sold already, so you can't have it. Uh, but next time they make these, ha, just kidding, they won't be doing that. Maybe you can get one. No, you can't. For the humping. I don't like to hump in large crowds. Small crowds? Usually just one. Usually. Typically. Typically just one.